please seek confirmation through prayer for this message. She thought she had successfully misled you, trying repeatedly. She believed she had deceived everyone, including you, by wearing a mask of false intentions. However, unbeknownst to her, you possessed a deeper insight, seeing through her disguise and understanding the true nature of her actions. Rather than revealing her deception immediately, your connection with angelic consciousness brought you a divine message. Subscribe to our channel if you believe that divine consciousness protects and guides you. You chose a path of patience and observation, allowing her to continue. Curious to see how far she would go in her deception, now the moment has come for the truth to be unveiled. She realizes that her facade has fallen, and she stands exposed for who she truly is. This revelation has brought a sense of vulnerability as she grapples with the consequences of her actions. Heavenly Father, we approach you with open hearts, acknowledging you as the ultimate source of truth and discernment. We seek your wisdom to handle this situation with grace and love. Write 111 if you trust in God. Help us extend forgiveness and understanding as we acknowledge that we, too, have received your mercy and grace. Amen. I affirm that God's truth triumphs over all falsehoods, uncovering every hidden agenda. My discernment is guided by divine wisdom, enabling me to see through deception. God's protection shields me from harmful intentions. I walk in integrity, upholding the values of honesty and transparency. May peace be with you. Write 22, confirm that God has a message for you. I want to remind you of what truly matters. I want you to feel strength in your soul, courage in your heart, and abundance in your spirit. Feel my presence surrounding you, giving you resilience in the face of all adversity. I offer you an endless source of hope in moments when challenges or unexpected events cause doubt or fear. My light is always available to you, you are never without my presence. Remember to express gratitude for all the blessings in your life. Prepare for miracles and signs of my presence. It will be something simple but will have a cascading effect that will surprise you. Pray to me every day with a grateful heart, and I will bless you abundantly. The road ahead may be tough, but you know you can face it. Your faith will guide you to new horizons. May God bless you. Like the video if you believe and share this message with your loved ones. God is going to change things in your favor. Trust in Him and thank Him in advance. Your victory is on the way. Something great will happen for you this weekend, only blessings, progress, and opportunities. God is telling you tonight, I am with you. Everything you do will be blessed. Your interview will be successful, your presentation will be amazing. I will highlight you and give you the words to say. I am opening new doors for you. Write 555 if you trust in God's plan. If you are in a season of waiting, let me encourage you, a delay does not mean denial, it may simply mean not yet. I have only the best in mind for my children. When the right time comes, I, the Lord, will make it happen. Three mountains are being removed from your life, difficulty, sickness, and deception in Jesus' name. An unexpected blessing and opportunity are coming your way. God will do the impossible for you. Even if you've had setbacks, doors are still opening for you by God's hand. Your victory is coming. God is about to deliver you from this struggle and make an example of His redeeming power. Eyes have not seen, ears have not heard the good things God has prepared for you. He is saying you deserve so much more. 
This is the last day you will stay stuck in a relationship that no longer serves you. Free yourself from debts, jobs that lack passion, and activities that don't bring joy. It's time for you to take a leap of faith. The blessing you've been waiting and praying for is about to come. Even if you've had setbacks, God is thanking you. God says, I know what you're going through because I know your heart. In this next stage of your life, I will bring people into your life who will help you, not hinder you. They will encourage you, not judge you. They are not part of your past, so they won't remind you of it. My child, keep your focus on me. Things are about to change in your favor. If you believe, you will receive everything you ask for in prayer. God is about to open a door that will change everything for you. God is transforming this selection and adversity into your greatest blessing. Write 999 if you believe. Trust in his timing and the process. God says, I have great plans for you. Your days will be filled with blessings, progress, and growth. Don't lose faith. Sometimes what seems like a disappointment is meant to position you for greatness. Some paths have closed. Be grateful he prevented you. The Lord has something much bigger and better for you. Watch what he will do next. Your upcoming blessing will change your future in a grand way. God is doing something new in your life. Don't be surprised when you are blessed from an unexpected place. God has a way of giving you exactly what you need when you need it. For those reading this, God understands how tough things are right now. He wants you to know that you are not alone and things are about to change in your favor. Keep holding on a little while longer. Your victory and the answers to your prayers are coming. Dear God, Today I open my heart and mind to receive all that you have for me. I trust that you are with me, guiding each of my steps. I accept your season of change and thank you for helping me grow in all areas. In Jesus' name, Amen. God is saying that you have prayed, cried, and sacrificed. It hasn't been easy, but you have persevered. You have passed the test. God says prepare to receive a blessing and advancements that will change your life. I am praying for all those who need a miracle. Only God can do the impossible. He can open a way when it seems like there's none. Today, I pray that God touches your health, your home, your family, your faith, and your finances. Amen. The next door that opens will place you in a position where you won't have to borrow or struggle. You need to trust the process while you wait. While you wait, things are growing and developing. God is gathering everything. Great opportunities are emerging. The wait wasn't a punishment, it was preparation. God has heard your prayer. Something good is about to happen to you. Amen. You have endured countless trials and borne immense pain. You've walked through scorching deserts that burned the soles of your feet and weakened your spirit with their intense heat. You left bloody footprints on the paths you traveled. While many people saw your suffering, no one showed pity toward you. Your faith remained steadfast, and that's why you're here today listening and preparing for the news I'm giving you. Beloved daughter, beloved son, I love you. The time has come to bestow upon you the blessing you've been waiting for so long. That which you've been faithful within little, I will now give you an abundance. Despite your distress, you held on to your faith, and I will grant you extraordinary happiness. Prepare to move into a new environment so that simplicity grows within you and your heart is filled with humility. 
Don't let pride and arrogance tempt you when you find yourself surrounded by abundance. Your faith has been strengthened, and it's time to entrust you with an even greater blessing. I will give you more because you invest your effort in what is eternal and you are not afraid of challenges or adversity. You will also walk on the waves and part the sea. You will manage the abundance that will soon arrive with humility and wisdom. You are brave, and you won't yield to the cruelty of bow or retreat. Feel the strength filling your soul. Raise your sword and shield of my word and continue forward without fear of anything or anyone. You are a hero of faith, a conqueror of giants, a miracle worker, and a bearer of blessings. I am igniting the holy fire in your heart and giving you the passion you need to build your life and fight for your family. You will realize that you are different. I have chosen you to overcome your own conflicts, rise, and help many people. Only you can feel it, you know it. If you understand, this is a great responsibility, and I will give it to you now. Tell me. Do you want to receive my love, my blessing, and my eternal power? Allow me to alleviate your distress and nervousness. Calm down a bit. Come here and lean your head on my shoulder for a moment. I am your God, the one who loves you and shows affection every time you close your eyes and cry like a child, not knowing what to do. Let's allow the world to continue its course but you and I will take some time to talk for you to share everything with me. I want you to feel better and leave here with renewed spirits, a strengthened heart, and a peaceful spirit full of joy. Fearful and sad thoughts invaded you as you woke up today, but I offer you a drink from my river of living water. I want your soul to rest and be filled with me. I want you to be happy. I know there are so many things attacking you, trying to steal your will to live, but I have never abandoned you. I have given you my love, my peace, my word, and all my mighty promises so that you can withstand. Here in my presence, there is an eternal flame that consumes all sin and impurity. However, if you believe the enemy and distance yourself from me, only smoke and ashes will remain where your love for me once burned. Pay attention. Close the door to pain and don't allow the negative emotions sown by others to dominate you. Have you felt tired of carrying the weight of the disdain from those you love so much? You've fought hard, and your efforts haven't been in vain even if no one appreciates it. Everyone is busy with their own concerns. If they don't show you even a bit of love, I understand your discouragement and worry. Those who I nourished abandoned me. Those whom I rescued turned away, only looking at me from the distance. Those close friends denied knowing me when asked about me. Trust in me because I truly know how you feel. And trust me with your sadness and sorrow. I am by your side. I will quench your thirst and fill you with words that will strengthen your faith. Your tears will turn into joy, and your blessing is near. With eternal love, I have loved you. My divine mercy will always be with you. Amen. God says do not despair. I am here to help you. Even before you utter a word, my ear is ready to listen to you. First, think that I love you and want to help you out of the situations and problems you face. You come to me today because you know I will lend you a hand to rise, heal all your wounds, and help you forget the past. I will make many blessings you had before return to you. I want you to know that I love you and admire you. I am delighted to see the brave attitude you have had in the face of conflicts. I want to encourage you to keep believing and trusting in me, a real, faithful, and powerful God. 
I ask you to avoid people who sometimes make fun of you and say things that steal your joy. They are not your friends, they are people who have lost faith and envy your destiny. They know you are loved and blessed, but they can never accept it. Don't waste your time trying to convince them or begging them for anything. I will take care of removing those who harm you from your path and bringing people into your life who truly love you. So leave behind the despair. Don't allow worry to occupy a place in your mind and don't let disturbing thoughts inhabit your soul. Do not open the door of your spirit to anything negative. Protect your mind with the helmet of faith. Cover your heart with the breastplate of righteousness. Take the sword of my holy word in your hands and prepare for a battle in which you will ultimately triumph. You will not be defeated, you will not suffer defeat ever again. Even if at some point you weaken, if you fall, I promise to lift you up once more. Accept the challenge. God says do not let anxiety enslave your future. Prepare to face discouragement and fear with all your strength. Trust me. Commit to triumph. Don't worry, these problems will pass and your distress will dissipate. Things will change. Allow me to take your thoughts and concerns into my hands. Let me help you preserve your peace. Worrying won't benefit you. Your mind must be alert and clear so you can stay steadfast. Anxiety will only generate more fear. Instead, take some time in the midst of your worries and talk to me. Tell me why you are afraid. Release those emotions that torment you and make you suffer inside. Your spirit needs me. Your heart is hungry. That loneliness you feel originates from the lack of me in your life. Fill yourself with me, my word, my presence, and my peace. The words I speak to you bring healing and freedom to your life. 